Hello everyone and welcome back to the Earth Recolonization Bureau in City Skylines and in this episode I'm going to begin again with a new city. Again I'm just trying to learn some of the tricks of the trade along the way and so still still building on my skills here in this game. Now somebody requested that I should do Mumbai, Bombay and I picked up a Mumbai map but I have a little bit of a problem with it which I'll show you. Let's uh, go new game Mumbai and start. So yeah, uh, when I go into the map, this is what I get. Uh, blankness. Nada. So if anybody knows why this might happen, maybe there's something I'm missing here. Uh, it is the only Mumbai map, so I have no choice here. So we'll try a different city until this one gets updated so that I can actually play on it. Please do suggest cities for me to do, and if there's a map on Steam Workshop, I'll pick it up and make sure to give it a go. But uh, for now, let us try... Let, let's try Seattle. I, I should actually just assign these to a die roll or something to do it all randomly, but uh, I feel like Seattle will be an interesting one this time. Okay, so let's go with Seattle. Okie dokie. So it's my first time seeing this map. I haven't checked it out to make sure it's okay. It looks okay. The main thing is that obviously we have the highway outlet here and stuff is flowing. We've got coastline. I, I mean obviously the thing is we need some water in the starting tile and we need the roads here to connect to so people can come in. Alright, so let's see. My normal pattern is to create a cross street like this and perhaps a nice broad street so something like that my normal pattern I don't know if it's the best thing to do or not now I think in the previous episode people were disconcerted because I was mixing up industry I was uh, a lot of my citizens were unhappy in their locations I think so I'm gonna try and do it a little bit more properly this time and make things while, uh, of course, in real life, you do have residences near near industrial uh, areas, but uh, I'm going to try and avoid that and try and do a slightly more optimal situation here. So I'm going to keep the... Let's take a look. Maybe we should have the industrial areas on the other side of the highway, actually. Wouldn't that be better? Seems like a bet... Uh, l let's reserve this area in between the railroad and the highway for the industrial areas. So... I'm gonna pass a, a road across here. I think I'm. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna like. It. Uh, maybe it, I was too close to the off ramp. I have no idea why I was so touchy and unable to make the road. But anyway, uh, we've got sort of a slope going there. So let me make it somewhat responsive to the contour of that. So this will be our, our industrial side, so we don't have the industry right next to the, the residences. And we'll probably have other overpasses going on that side as well. Okay. So again, I'm just playing for three hours, and then we'll see how this city ends up based on that. Let's see now. Water, which way are you flowing? You're not really flowing very much, are you, water? Uh, let's see. Oh, maybe the arrows? No, no, there's just no water flow here. That's a bit dangerous. This, These seem like the natural place to pump water from, but they also seem a little bit confined, so maybe we won't get enough water like that. This is much better than the Sendai map, where, where we definitely had uh, water constraints on those two little rivers. I don't think that they were giving us the supply we needed. Wow, that's pretty far, actually. Should have made that a little bit closer. It's gonna cost a lot to hook it all up. But I do like not having my my water supply right next to the sewage. Oh, I, I made the... Oh, great. Early in the morning, I made the power lines to the wrong thing. I thought those were... But the, no, those, those are not. Uh, let's just, uh, let's not bulldoze. Let's add power lines like this. Okay. Alright, let's colonize. Recolonize. Uh, let's, let's create some sub-roadways sub here. So, let's make sure that's watered properly. Yeah. 
that, that area is, but this this area is not. Now I really should try out with the coal power plant, starting out with the coal power plant and see how that works at some point. Uh, power, power, power. Okay, so we have our first residential area. This is just my typical pattern, right on the off-ramp having the commercial area. I think that's okay, right? That That's a smart thing to do. And our planned industrial park over there. Let's send another overpass road. I think that's probably wise at this point. Okay. So that seems okay. Alright, peoples. More peoples. Power, power, power. Actually, you guys should have your own power plant. Uh, we'll also run wires across. If we can. Okay. Gotta be careful about building residences right now. Oh, reached 380. Does it seem... Uh, the, do these accomplishments go down? I could have sworn it was like 500 initially, not 380. So, I don't know. Okay, I need some better roads here. Um, let's have something following the coastline a little bit better. Let's see, we got one of these here. There's a steep slope there. I really don't want it to curve in like that. Not quite what I wanted, but I guess I'll take it. Okay, so we need some roads connecting up to that. So now let's get some services if we've got the cash. The dump can be safely placed over here, I think. Now oh, we need power. Well, our availability is okay. We don't have much cash right now anyway. Let's see if we can take out a loan. Just so I can build out this capacity and make sure we can continue to grow here. Alright, so Seattle is coming along. New Seattle. I should have put New Seattle, yeah. Come on. I'm only vaguely familiar with the layout of Seattle. It's not like we were going to match that with this anyway. Now, a good location for services. Probably right around here. We should expand... How's traffic? Well, I mean, right now it's early on, but... I bet this road is going to need to be expanded. Probably don't want to put a service right there. Because that's going to have to be bulldozed in order to expand this road here. Um, this road is already as big as it's going to get. So the services should be on there. Let's see. We can't build that yet. Already got the landfill. So just wait. Uh, well, hmm. Okay, uh, time warp, time warp. Every time uh, you get one of the city achievements, it uh, breaks your time warp. That uh, always kills me, because I need to keep the speed up, otherwise the funds don't replenish in time for me to do critical things. Okay, uh, well, if we're going to build the services there, let's get some more residential here. Okay, Worthy Village. So, uh, tell me what you think about the pacing of the series, by the way. That's got to be important. Obviously, I'm still doing live commentary during this. And that has the potential for making things feel a little bit slow. So I do want to know how that's going. No, nope. residential demand is high. Guess we'll just build that out. Okay, I think this temporary power line can go. Alright, uh, somebody remind me to check the tweets. Uh-huh. Uh, okay, well, I think people want some sort of police. Yeah, maybe. But we don't have any cash right now. Fire hazard's still pretty high. Space station reaches Earth orbit? What? What? Luxury resort hotel plans underway. Hashtag astronomy, hashtag hotels. Okay. 
Freedom Star Space Station. Got it. When's our city gonna get a school? Well, when I get the budget for one. Yeah, I guess uh, looking at these uh, aren't so bad in the context of storytelling. I say that because of the space station one, of course. Tiny Town! Okay, Tiny Town gets its school. Let's put it on the main roadway. Yes, Mayor supports education. Citizens approve of this. Good, good, good. Because you guys are paying for it. Let's get some police here. Police should be relatively close to... Well, let's just put it with our... Our commercial district here right now. Don't have too much funds, but maybe we can add a park somewhere? Didn't really make the spaces big enough for this sort of thing. Uh, there we go. Go on, you can fit in there, right? Okay, well, those guys are a little bit left out. Let's get some commerce here. It'll be good for the electricity flow. We can get rid of this wire going across. Apartment rents are rising. Yes, demand is high. Yes. Actually, this area is sort of more like a corner store kind of thing, but... Let's go with this. Okay, a bustling little burrow. 1,500 and growing. Still waiting to be able to build a firehouse. Uh, I think our funds can sustain this loan here. Fire hazard is still 29%. It's these guys in here that don't seem to be getting serviced here. We'll need to build a bigger firehouse at some point to reach them. Uh, medical availability seems okay. Schools. High school. Okay, we've got a high school. Okay, it'll be electricity that's going to be the main problem. Let's see, maybe we can put a coal power plant off the side here. We've got uh, funds... see. We'll clean it up later. Let's get one in first. Okay, so we have gone coal for the first time. And let me have another roadway above here. Let's get it there and then... Okay. And now little fiddly bits. Ah, not enough money. Ah, we're losing money. Okay, time to zone stuff. The city is growing to meet the needs of the expanding city. That's what we've got right here, right now. We've got power lines nowhere, and that's not a good thing. But eventually we'll have to do something with that. Okay, reached a population of 2,000, and our budget issues are... are Somewhat solved. Okay. Oh, unhappy, are you? Well, I'm afraid you're gonna get some neighbors. Now, let's see about services. That one is taking care of the health capacity. Probably we're gonna put some services near this main road, but on the inside here. Fire safety is still an issue for these guys inside. Uh, we could probably extend that roadway a little bit. Hmm. Actually, let's upgrade the roadway. That's what we could do. Does that help? Sorta. Yeah, let's upgrade some roadways to make sure that the fire trucks can get in. We've got a lot of places to link the highway up to, though, now. We don't have the same problem as last time. And I've got a lot of... Roads. Okay, hold on, though. I'm still not good at all with the whole building overpasses and such things like that. So, I gotta... 
Actually, these aren't particularly convenient to link up to the highway, are they? This one, this one might work. I always want the the connections to be concave, and it always ends up convex. Somebody please tell me why I'm getting that problem. Yeah, I want it like that. Ugh, whatever. Let's go with that for now. Uh, the overpass part can't be upgraded, but this can. Schools, not going so well. Um, how about one... Like here. And another one here. Could do with another fire station somewhere here, but I think I need to bulldoze something. Let's pause so that it doesn't rebuild, and I will bulldoze you and you. Pollution. Well, pretty much where you'd expect it to be. The coal power plant's not doing as much horrible stuff as I would expect, actually. Fire sta safety would be improved if I could connect that up. Let's do that. What could these guys possibly need? Uh, okay, enough of that. Go away. Abandoned, low-density commercial building. Maybe police? How is that? No, crime rate is fine and the police station is right there. Maybe they just don't have enough workers. Okay, well, we need jobs, 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 anyway. So I've still been watching EJSA on Twitch doing his City Skylines thing, and what, what he's trying to do is actually drain the ocean. Uh, progressively uh, reclaiming land by the use of dams, and that's like way beyond where I am right now, that's for sure. So obviously, if you want to learn how to do the crazy things in City Skylines, that, that would be the place to go. Cemetery. Probably around here will be fine. Big road. Yeah, I think this is probably the best place. Uh, limited reach over here. Let me put one down the road here. Okay, time for some serious brushing here. And let's relocate some of our power plants, yeah? Uh, let's see now. That guy. You go over here, actually. Okay, that gives us some room. Don't worry, we'll, we'll move the wind turbines at some point. I'm informing my residents of this, of course. Okay, more residentials. Uh-oh. Sewage problems, why? There can't be power issues yet. Yes, there are. Wow. Hmm. Okay. That came up. So, ladies and gentlemen, 3,000 population this is what it looks like so far. Seattle. New Seattle. I think the Seattle city center is up north here, right? Pretty sure that's south. This is this this side's north. This area here is the city center, or is it down here actually? All I know is I think uh, Boeing is over here somewhere. I think so. Okay. School availability is good. Oh, let's build some buses. We're around the edge of that though, but yeah. Yeah, I guess the bus depot is a thing. Should be pretty easy to encompass this place with buses. So let's see, let's start out at the depot. I think the key is to add the stops not where the big road is.
but I think we're gonna have to send this across here. Okay, line complete. So it goes around like that. We'll see how that works out. I'm going for more of a grid pattern this time, aren't I? I think it's the layout of the land, honestly. I think it's just the way the land flows sort of lends itself to that. I think another road here would be a good idea. This seems like a good area for a park, actually. Let's get some beautification going. Make sure water is in all of our expanded districts now. Water seems to be not flowing there. Okay. I see what I did there. Cemetery usage is still 0%. We've got two of them. Uh, well, you know what? Uh, I'll build another healthcare facility just, just for the heck of it here. Uh, we've got 100 citizens being transported by bus per week. Landfill usage is creeping up. We could probably extend down here near the coal power plant to put the rest of the landfill stuff. Probably it's... wow the music is loud. Okay, probably it's not a good idea to put the landfills near the industry as well. People could get sick at work, right? Can they? Okay, I think it's time to purchase some other locations. I think over here would be good, right? Why can't I turn the camera? Oh well, whatever. Um, well, th that's that has a natural outlet there. That's good. But then we seem to be tending towards this direction, aren't we? Well, look at all our roads. I think we're mostly expanding this way, and the highway will continue to create a natural border between the industrial area and the rest of the city. So okay, we'll we'll take we'll purchase this area. Outside connections, chip connections even, wow. Okay. Alright. Let me put some more residential here. And maybe that'll encourage me to get rid of those power lines and expand in this direction. Uh oh, power, power. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, the one is on that. Okay, power, power, power. Well, let's just, uh, coal does not seem to have as much drawback as I thought. Certainly a quick fix. Okay, busy town. 3,800. Again, uh, it seems like the, the key numbers for all these achievements has changed from time to time. And consistently going down. We really need an industrial grade fire station. We're getting close to the point where we can afford one. Maybe... I, w I wonder what the fire safety hazard... Whether 27% is really high? Is that high? I mean, it seems high compared to the crime rate. But maybe it's... I should think of it in different terms. Okay, anyway. More... More stuff. I think we should plunge ahead to 7,500. I should just build things out and head for that. Well, is it 7,500 anymore? That's what it was previously, I think. The key number to get high density stuff in particular. Okay, nanobot research funded by many governments. The possibilities are endless. Okay, where do I sign up? How do we fund nanobot research? I think we can get rid of this power line, which will enable me to build a road there. Come on, turn into an overpass. Come on! I can sense that it wants to. Yes! Okay, so this is our city one hour in. Remember, three hours 
is what I'm giving to this for our initial plunge into colonizing New Seattle. Looks like our industrial sector... You know, this time I won't uh, completely eviscerate the industrial sector and replace it with office space. I think we should uh, create a little residential area off the side here for them. I think they need to continue their activities. I don't want to get rid of them this time. Still haven't built railroads in this. Uh-oh, landfills have a limited capacity. That's that's not a good sign. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. It's just uh it's just cuz one of them is filled probably. Okay, so we'll keep the residents on this side of the railroad tracks at least. Not have them right up next to the the in industry. We'll put some parks in between. There, that'll improve their land value. We won't put them too close to the power plants, I think there's enough space. We'll put some industry here. Let's put some commerce here. Make sure it's all watered. Okay, we need more. Uh, wow. The sewage is really getting close to our our water source. I want to put this water source here then. And I'm going to have it have its own dedicated power source just so that we don't have any issue with that. As for sewage treatment, well, all I can do is put one over here. Let's try and angle it away maybe. Like that. Okay, so that's online. High school availability is poor now. Well, we'll want to put those over here, I think. Healthcare, ooh, 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 bad. Okay, it looks like these guys over here need some. Probably these guys over here will too. Once I start building out the residential area here, which I'm doing right now. So these guys will get first dibs on the industrial jobs. We should create a timber industry, shouldn't we? We'll do that over here. We've got uh, a lot of timber. Let's see, uh, uh, we should buy this plot of land. Well, that's our limit right now. So let's say around here we have a timber industry of some sort. Seems like the thing to do in the Pacific Northwest, right? Strawberry District. Sounds good to me. So there's forest industry. Very good. And now let's build some... Well, let's get some water to it. Power. Yes, that's gonna be an issue. Let's actually do power by running the residence all the way across to it. Heck, you know what? Let's just put a windmill right in the middle of all that. We seem to need power anyway. You don't seem like you're gonna blow anything up. Alright. Power. Only two megawatts though. Well, that's not worth it. Well, heck, let's just build a few here and run the power lines. Actually, I think I should transplant some of these over there as well. But let me build one more. Big Town! Uh, it... Yeah, we get high density at 6,000? Is that just this map, or is that now a thing for me? I don't know. Seems early. So, more peoples. Well, let's get some high density peoples. You guys probably won't mind living close to the farm, right? Healthcare will still be a necessity. Let's put it on the main road. Now what? Not enough workers. Well, I'm, I'm trying to get you workers. Don't worry. Okay. Well, I think we can leave this district to be the Strawberry District. Again, I need to work on my names. But we'll leave it be for now. 
Okay, uh, time warp a little bit more. We need to work on our city center, I think. These guys probably need some stuff. Gotta start working on high density, but I'm not gonna bulldoze stuff yet, or at least, I mean, not the zone stuff, I mean. Well, let's encourage people to come into our city, but never leave. Let's upgrade this road, too. University! Ah, we, we get to do that sort of thing again. Crime. Wow, well, the... The law definitely has a long arm in this game, but I think we could... Oh, good. 8,000, finally. Small city. Okay, uh, probably could use another police station there. Yeah, I think we can build a university over here. That'll do. And another high school, too. And here we'll have the office space, but we won't do that just yet. Let's first of all make sure that they're powered. Uh, probably power lines from the sewage system. I hope they don't mind. Facilitated by... Yeah, let's get some office space up front here. And I think usually college towns need some commerce. Lots of commerce. Okay, let's see what the tweeter says. Ah, uh, yeah. Warned about the water. Okay, fine. Our city is growing to the point where I probably should pay attention to that. And then also these trash can signs. It is incinerator time. Now, the incinerators were powerful bad stuff last time. Let's see. There doesn't seem to be anything volatile here. So maybe it'll be safe. Probably shouldn't have all of them in the same place. But maybe it's safer that way too. Put it near the highway. Landfill near the timber industry? Nah. High density seems to have worked out okay. Let me put more of it. Let's get some more industry here, too. Okay, things are growing apace. This is what it looks like right now. We now have a strawberry district there. Let's name some districts. Let's identify the districts. Um, so let's do that. Amity district? I'll take their names for now. I'll, I'll come up with different names later. Uh-oh, we've got sick people. Hold on. That takes precedence. Let's let's see now. On a big road, we need a hospital. So what I'm gonna say is, hold on. I want to take a look at this situation. I don't want to bulldoze the sick sick people just to build the hospital for them. Why don't we make this road bigger? Upgrade the road, and then we'll build a hospital at it. Oh, there's something there. How about here? Well, it looks like I'm gonna be bulldozing something, but can't be helped. I want some access to this hospital if I'm gonna build it. Well, I guess that'll have to do. Let's see. Can we upgrade this section now? It says space already occupied. I think it's the slope. Anyway, that's good enough to build a hospital at. A little bit unsightly, but... Let's put it at this corner. Uh, it's too tight. Okay. Fire hazard. Well, let's solve that. We've got a huge issue here, but there's no need for that. We can easily build a full-size fire department here. And it looks like we could use another one here. But we don't have enough money. Okay. But things are proceeding. 
Let us zone. Waterworks. Okay, what's up with the waterworks? Ah, uh, yeah, we're we're not having enough water here. Water is there. Healthcare could use some serious work. Our hospital is not online or something? Or people can't get to it? No, it seems to be online. What's the heal capacity on the hospital? It's got 500 only. We've got a lot of sick people. How do we have that many sick people? That's impossible. We've got 5,000 sick sick... Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Uh, do you guys tell me anything? I think we've got the plague. 